Wow. Wow, kind of truck looker. <laughs> oh my god. Will I actually be able to beat this with a faulty controller? Or is it just hopeless? I'm just wondering if I'm able to actually do this with this goddamn controller. That's a piece of shit. That's just fighting every goddamn thing I do. No matter what I do. It's a piece of shit controller. That's what it is. Wow. I'm fucking believable. Oh my god, that's not where I would want to go! Fucking shit. Because I'm probably pissed off, that can't be why. Oh, now we're going in the opposite direction, huh? Alright. That's fucking great. Wow! God damn this controller! God. But yeah, first time I first time in. Thank God knows how long. I was actually in front of him on lap two. 
Oh, go fucking figure on that piece of shit. I'm sliding. Doesn't register. Come on. Is it the controller? It's sure, and it's certainly not fucking me. Is it the game? More than likely, it's the fucking game. Wow. Holy fucking shit. William P. for fuck's sake. Get the hell out of my way. Really? Really? The fuck was that? Come on. God, I'm so... I am beyond pissed at many things. Beyond pissed that he just doesn't lose his fire at all to give a chance at the very fucking least. Not even before the blue boost pad. Not even on the last lap. <laughs> Again, I do the drift and nah, nah, it forces me to do the long way. Wow. The controller doing piece of shit. Just, the controller's being shitty again. PS5 controller's being shitty again. Who would have guessed? Evidence is online now, and I am very livid when it should not be doing this, especially when we've only had the PS5 for only a couple of months. I can feel it pulling every fucking where, and it's so... Oh my god, I hate it. I freaking hate it. It's not it's not the level level I'm pissed off at. I'm still pissed off at the level, but nah, it's not the only thing now. It's the piece of shit controller. Wow. God damn. This stupid fucking thing. Heaven forbid if it should go in the right direction. 
Heaven fucking forbid if it should go in the right direction. Yeah, of course, as soon as I figure out how to actually do this level with blue fire, then the controller starts acting up and starts being a piece of shit. tries throwing me off course. Which is... <sighs> and I keep trying to course correct myself, but because of that bullshit I have to do, I don't have enough boost to get where I need to go. It's such horseshit. God damn it, Sony. Yeah, I'm blaming you, too. <laughs> I'm blaming Sony partially for this. Because... The controller was kinda... I mean, it looks nice, but this one that we got was very poorly constructed. Because it was not built to last, apparently. Because the analog stick is already fucking up. When it should be able to last for years. Fucking years. <sighs> if I had a working controller, then I'd be able to do this just fine. I could have won that. I could have fucking won that. Then I could truly take a break and get a new controller. Not now. No. As soon as I figured out how to fucking do this level, then the controller farks up and it pisses me off. Wow. Slowest thing I've ever seen. Shouldn't be that slow, and yet it is. What the hell is going on?
doesn't register jumping. Which is also bullshit. <laughs> that's that's exactly the shit I'm talking about. <laughs> that's exactly the shit I'm talking about. It drifts me the wrong direction. It's not me. You like you've been seeing how pretty consistent I was. <laughs> Although you couldn't exactly see because of this goddamn broken controller. Oh my god, this is such f I was in front of them too! Just had us drift the wrong fucking way, didn't we, you stupid goddamn piece of shit controller? Holy fucking shit, I'm so mad. No drifting there either, okay, that's fucking grandastic. <laughs> Mmm, -hmm. mm -hmm. tomorrow, I don't care, I'm gonna go get a new controller, this is bullshit, I shouldn't have to put up with this bullshit, I really shouldn't, I really shouldn't pull up, I really shouldn't have to pull up and put up with this fucking bullshit, it's so fucking stupid, I swear to god if I don't find a new controller though, I swear to fucking god if I don't find a new controller. Go away, William P. I don't want to see your face. Go the fuck away. I am sick of seeing your face on this damn level.
And the whole time I was, I was, I, I didn't care if I even tied a score. I didn't care if I beat him by like a second or a few milliseconds. I did not give a shit. I just needed to do something to tie his time at the very fucking least. I've beaten a developer, you're fucking goddamn right I have. Despite the goddamn controller being such a piece of shit. With the stupid analog stick deciding on where the hell it wants to go. God fucking damn. That was ridiculous. Like I said, like, it took a while to figure out exactly, like, I knew the track, I knew what was to come, what to, what was to come, but... <sighs> but holding blue fire, especially at the last part, that... That took the most time away trying to figure out how the hell to do that part. So, what I did was I used analog stick for most of the track, and when it came to that stupid U-turning short, uh, shortcut where you gotta do that sharp turn there near the end of the track, I switched to directional button, the directional pad, because I tried doing analog stick before, it was not working for me at all. So, that is why I decided to and, like I like I try like I have tried both methods, using analog stick then the directional pad but, and using analog stick the entire time. But then I decided to switch back to the switch to analog stick and then the directional pad, which was in turn more accurate because U turning. I managed to pull it off once. I am not. I'm gonna keep going on about that because. I'm gonna keep going on about it. Against my original ghost, I managed to pull off the shortcut three times in a row with the analog stick. But god, it was not easy in the slightest when I'm going up against a developer, probably because there's more pressure going on. When it's just my own ghost is like, I know what I did, but what the hell does the developer do? Oh, some nonsense. Oh, I'm. You know, I'm, I noticed he took a little wide of a turn on the last lap there, at the, la at the very end. <sighs> and also, he's, he's, like, on lap one, uh, you, yeah, you've seen what I've been doing for lap one the whole time. Like, you can get in front of him on lap one, but it's pretty much right there that you have to do it. Otherwise, like, and you can if you if you keep up with him though, and you reach the and you reach the part where you have to do where you have to cut through the clouds basically. Yeah, that's the part coming up, but yeah, basically the part where you have to cut through the clouds if you keep up with him. Then and if you and if you do that shortcut better, and you can do that shortcut better than he does, as you've seen. <laughs> Where I'll just, and the, throughout the video, you've seen how I did that, and yeah, it is possible to get it just a few more milliseconds back just to get back in front of him. If you're just behind him, then, but yeah, yeah. Anyway, what? Hey, let's see. All right, today. <laughs> I could, yeah, I could upload all the, all the time, all, all the different sessions that I've tried for this stupid level. I could. But I've already let out a rage video of eight whole minutes, so I don't think I need to do a couple other videos on my failures and all the problems I've had with the animal box stick. Okay, but yeah, today, it took an hour and a half. Yeah, cause I got, cause I came back and I'm like, all right, let's freaking do this with this broken analog stick controller that just wants to go wherever it wants to. It has a mind of its own. I'm blaming William P. Anyway, <laughs> he's cursed everything. Anyway, I'm that might be all I do tonight. 
that's probably all I'm gonna do tonight. But I'm s still gonna get a new controller though, because <laughs> I don't want to do any more developer time trials where it, oh, there's like a 30 millisecond, 30 second difference, and there's you turning involved. I'm gonna go. Yeah, yeah, my second time there, two thirteen seventy three. So I was damn close. For that last the last session I did. And now I got 21346, which I think is a tie, but I don't care. Good job, Pinstripe. Good job, me. Oh, there's that fourth star. And I know I've complained about Oxide Station, but then again, I haven't really played it that much as on the Velo time trial, but uh, yeah, let's just take a look. 312.05. I don't care if that's harder or like, I know that's easier to do because I actually like that track. I honestly do. I did it in the original and I still do. I think it's really cool and I'm like, wee when it's, when it's, Zero gravity of like, oh, this is so damn cool. So yeah, yeah, I liked it then. I have liked it now. Same with Slide Coliseum, and same with Turbo Track. I know if the Turbo Track is hard, but I know he loses fire on the third lap, which makes that in turn way easier. And plus, Turbo Track is a lot shorter than Hot Air Skyway, because because Hot Air because. Turbo Track is basically a circle with a little Z. Hot Our Skyway is a bunch of circles. Let's see. 213.46. Oh! 213.46. 213.49. I didn't tie it, but. <laughs> it was damn close. Three milliseconds difference. Oh. Oh. But if it ended up like it, at least it wasn't. Well, Crash Cove was easier. Yes, Crash Cove is easier than freaking Hot Air Skyway here, which Lord knows how long it actually took me in in re in actuality, because I know it's got to be over ten hours, something like that. Whew. But yes, Otter Skyway is finally done. The nightmare is over! The nightmare is over, yay! I'm gonna go now. Goodbye. Ugh. <laughs>